Do you have a Wix website and want to enable Instagram and Facebook shopping on your site and have automatic product uploads so you don't have to always manually upload the product to the catalog? Well, in this video, I will share with you step by step how to enable Instagram shopping for your Wix site or business. So let's get started. Hi, I'm Lydia and on this channel we'll talk about social media marketing for business and how to make more money online. So if you're interested in those topics, make sure to subscribe. So what do you need to enable Instagram and Facebook shopping for your Wix site? I'm making this video specifically for your Wix business because the process is different when you want to integrate the catalog at the end and enable automatic product upload. So let's see what you need for this feature to work. The first thing you need is an Instagram account that is a business one and that has demonstrated trustworthiness, which means your follower base is big enough. Between 200 and 500 followers is my suggestion if you are just starting out and also you need engagement engagement on your page and to post daily and be active. Another thing you need is a Facebook page for your business that you create from your Facebook account and that you optimize with a profile image, description, website link, button and again you share all the Instagram posts to your Facebook page as well and my suggestion is to have at least 100 to 200 likes on the page before applying for this feature. The next thing you need is obviously your Wix website with a unique domain that you've purchased and a paid plan so you cannot do this with the free version that they offer you. You also need to sell physical products that comply with their commerce policies, see the link below to see which are the products and to make sure that products can be directly purchased from your website. You will also need a Facebook commerce account and a catalog with your products. But let's talk more about that. First, my advice is to not go to Wix and to sales channels and directly connect your Facebook and Instagram account and try and enable this feature like that. As with Shopify, this will not work and most likely will cause errors. So if you've already tried applying and you've got rejected, just go to Wix, disconnect those channels and then follow my instructions. Don't worry, these will get connected at the end when we will enable the automatic product upload. Next, you need to verify your Wix domain. To do that, make sure to go to your Facebook business manager, go to business.facebook.com if you don't have one already, then go to commerce, more tools, business settings, brand safety and domains, and add your domain there with the extension .com, .co or whatever it is for your site. Then there are two ways in which you can verify that domain and the first one is for you to grab the HTML code that you will add to the head section of your Wix website. To do that, go to Wix, click edit site, settings, scroll down to advanced, and select custom code, then click on add a new code. Paste the snippet that you've copied from Facebook, give it a name, and then make sure that the code applies to all pages on the website and that it is added to the head section of the site. Then click apply. After that, you will be able to go back to Facebook, to domains and click the green verify button and your domain should get verified. If it doesn't happen immediately, it is because the code hasn't been implemented in your site yet and it can take up to three days for that to happen. If it doesn't happen after three days, there are some errors that you can fix by following this video right here. Or as always, you can contact me on Instagram at lida.incomingsuccess if you have any questions or errors or just need help with this feature. The next step will be creating your catalog. If you don't have one already, you will need to go to business settings, data sources, catalogs and click add. And then once you've created the catalog, you will get the option of clicking open in commerce manager. If you already have a catalog that has been rejected, you might want to follow this video. If your sales channels are already connected there, you won't be able to remove those sales channels until the commerce account is approved. So this video will help in learning what to do. But if you're brand new and you want to enable this feature and your sales channels are unconnected sales channels, I mean, Instagram account and Facebook page, you can go open in commerce manager and click add items and add multiple items. I suggest adding 10 items manually by adding their picture, their title, description, website link and price and make sure that in stock is selected for all of them. Once you did that, you need to ensure that your commerce manager is very well set up before applying for this feature. So again, as I mentioned, make sure to not apply before both of your accounts are demonstrating trustworthiness and have a sufficient follower base. But another thing that you need to do is go to your commerce account, go to settings and fill out all the information there, including shipping and returns. Make sure your email is there, your business name and all of that. 
If your sales channels aren't connected, it is because your account is brand new, your catalog is new, and you will want to connect them only when you apply for this feature, which means when you want to enable this feature and open the shop. So when you're ready for that and you have a sufficient follower base and everything else set up, you can go to shops, create shop, and start by connecting your email address, your catalog, your sales channel, select your domain, and also select that you agree with their policies. Once you do that, your shop will be in review view and it can take up to two weeks for you to receive an answer. If you receive a rejection answer, such as products are not available on your website or anything else, you can find the solutions for those errors in this video right here. But again, you can always contact me on Instagram and ask me about this feature and I also have a service that I offer to help out with setting up this feature properly. So if you need help with that, make sure to contact me on Instagram at lydia.incomingsuccess or on my email at lydia.incomingsuccess.com. Once your account will get approved for this feature and you will be able to see that in your commerce account and you will most likely also get a notification on your Instagram account saying that you're ready to start tagging products. You can now go to your Wix site, click edit site, go to channels and click Facebook and connect your Facebook account. Then select your Facebook page, the shop, and once everything is connected, your products should start syncing to your catalog. You'll be able to start tagging them in posts. If you don't know how to do that, a link to a video is down below, and you'll be able to create unique collections for your shop. You'll also be able to see that in the video below. If you're looking for ways to troubleshoot in case your account got rejected, make sure to follow the playlist in the description that has all the information you need to know. And if you still need help, again, don't hesitate to come contact me. So there you go, this is how you enable Instagram shopping for your Wix site, as well as Facebook shopping and enable automatic products upload to your catalog. If this video was helpful, don't forget to leave it a like and subscribe down below for more such videos every single week. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and on TikTok at Lydia.IncomingSuccess for more advice on making money online and more. Thank you so much for being here and I will see you in my next video.